Here's your 41 Now update, sponsored by Kansas City Regional Association of Realtors. I'm Cynthia Newsom. This is 41 Action News. Quentin Lucas will be the next mayor of Kansas City. He defeated Jolie Justice in last night's general election. And the unofficial final results were not close. Lucas defeated Justice by nearly 19 percentage points, 59 to 41 percent. Lucas celebrated the win last night at his campaign headquarters. The mayor-elect joined anchors Lindsay Shively and Tom Dempsey this morning on 41 Action News Today. Lucas talked about his priorities for Kansas City and said the city has to learn to tackle several big projects at the same time. I've been saying across the campaign trail ad nauseum, which is that we need to walk and chew gum. You know, in Kansas City, sometimes we just venture from one or the other. It's either get the steel plates off the roads or build a new airport. I think we can do both. And so what we need to do is make sure each year is a priority. We're doing those things like paying for infrastructure, avoiding potholes, right? Paying for enough police officers on the streets, but then also being creative, using our minds to make sure this city is better for the next generation. You can watch the full interview with Mayor-elect Lucas and our morning team. Go to KSHB.com and look in our web link section on the right side of the home page. Then just click on the link. Your weather is next. Are you getting ready to sell your house? Did you know a realtor can provide an objective point of view on what repairs need to take place before you sell to get the best price? Visit KCRAR.com to find a realtor near you. Good afternoon. We're two days away from the start of summer. Today is not going to feel anything really like that. Temperatures will only top out in the mid 70s. We have north winds and a chance for showers and storms later on today, especially through the afternoon and evening. Well, our disturbance that's going by is continuing to bring us those rain chances and well, they'll die down as we move later on into tonight. So after sunset, things will start to quiet down. Temperatures dropping to the 60s overnight tomorrow, quite a bit warmer, low to mid 80s. No problem and we'll have a lot more sunshine too. A small chance for a shower pretty late in the afternoon and overnight, but uh, otherwise will be much drier as well. Now moving into Friday again, the beginning of summer, it'll start feeling like that beginning in the 70s, warming up to the 80s and even near 90 degrees in a lot of spots. We're going to be tracking more showers and storms possible here. Some of those could actually be on the strong side with some damaging winds or some large hail possible. We'll be uh, keeping a close eye on that. In the meantime, you can get all your latest weather and news updates on KSHB.com. Cutting the cable cord? 41 Action News is now on Roku. Search KSHB, add our channel, and you're set. All of our newscasts stream live. No other station in Kansas City can say that. Get clear, complete coverage on 41 Action News now on Roku.